Keyboards are user-definable and disallow the placement of conductive objects. There are tools for creating areas in the active bar and in the Place Keyboard menu. Keyboard zones can be placed on the desired signal layers or on the Keyboard layer, then the action will be distributed to all signal layers. Let's consider how to create and how to work with Keyboard. First, let's create a Keyboard area around the mounting hall using a circle. In the properties of the Keyboard object, you can edit the dimensions and specify the types of objects for which placement in this area is prohibited. To prevent the polygon from filling inside the circle, enable the Remove that Cover property from it. The exclusion zone only affects the layer where it is located. Place the keyboards on the keyboard layer so that all signal layers are affected. Don't forget to re-pour the polygons on other layers. In the case of a more complex keyboard area, it can be drawn using the track tool from the keyboard menu. When building, Using the Shift plus Space keys, you can switch the corner drawing modes to achieve the desired shape of the keyboard area. These methods will help to constrain the polygon fill area, but they do not inhibit the placement of conductive objects inside a closed area formed by the keyboard zone and the edge of the board. To completely disable placement in any area, use the Solid Region tool from the keyboard menu. When drawing, using the Shift plus Space keys, you can also switch the corner styles. This keyboard shortcut also works after placing a region while editing its shape. More complex regions can be composed of simple ones. Copy the region with the anchor point and paste to create the desired shape. When pasting, use the spacebar to rotate X or Y to flip the region along the X and Y axis. Keyboard regions can be converted from closed paths drawn with the drag tool. First, let's consider a not quite standard way. Let's say we need a keyboard zone to partially repeat the board outline. You can use the routing tool, enable follow mode with the Shift plus F keyboard shortcut and hover over the edge of the board. It should be noted that for this mode to work, the board outline clearance rule must be configured or the board outline must be created in the keyboard layer. Let's remove all unnecessary and complete the required close contour. To create a keyboard zone, we first convert this outline to a region. Select the segment, press the tab key to select the entire path and choose create region from selected primitives from the tools convert menu. The resulting region is a cast copper patch. We can also convert such a region into a keyboard zone through the tools Convert, Convert Selected Primitives to Keyboard menu. Don't forget to delete the original track as it is on the signal layer. A violation occurs because the mounting hole is located in the keyboard area. You can edit the keyboard region shape and go around the hole or in the properties you can uncheck the through hole pad checkbox. A close contour for a keyboard region can be drawn initially in a mechanical layer. Also, it can be imported from DWG and DXF files. The approach to create a keyboard is the same as before. Select the contour and convert it to a region. The resulting region is then converted into a keyboard. The only difference is that when a region is converted to a keyboard from a mechanical layer, it goes to the keyboard layer. Don't forget to repour polygons. If necessary, move the keyboard region from the keyboard layer to the required signal layer, also not forgetting to repour the polygons. Disable the through hole pad restriction. Let's consider another way to create complex forms of keyboard regions by subtracting one region from another. Let's create a region of the base form as well as several regions that should be subtracted from it. Let's draw one region to subtract. Copy it and paste it with rotation. Then select the base region from the context menu, run the polygon actions, subtract polygons from selected command, select the polygons to subtract and press the right mouse button. Subtraction has occurred. 
but the keyboard region has been converted to copper. So let's run the convert selected primitive to keyboard command. Thus, in various ways, it is possible to obtain rather complex forms of the keyboard zones. It is also worth noting that the clearance to the keyboards is set in the clearance rule in the region column.